Hey guys, Matthew Sunny 90 here. Today is Saturday, October the 2nd, and right now I'm just chilling here in my room. Yeah. Yeah, I'm just chilling in my room. Saturday, it's October 2nd. It's the second day of October. Hey, let's go. Yeah, and right now it's about 2.37 in the afternoon. Uh, this is just going to be a little update video just to see how you guys are doing. Uh, I just decided to just make a video. I know I said I probably wasn't going to do a video today, but I'm actually just going to do a video today because why not, so, yeah. And uh, right now I'm actually watching YouTube. I'm actually watching uh, Channel Boy 12's newest vlog, which actually, if you guys can see, it got uploaded today. Hope you guys saw that. Yeah, it just got uploaded today, so, yeah, I actually want to give Channel Boy 12 a shout out. I'm actually, you know what, guys? I might do something new. I might do shout out Saturdays where every Saturday I'm gonna give I'm gonna do a video every Saturday and I'm gonna give a YouTuber a shout out every Saturday. So yeah, so go subscribe to Channel by 12 and put his channel link in the description below. And uh, yeah, I'll also post his new vlog in the description as well if you guys wanna check that video out. So uh, yeah, go subscribe to Channel by 12 and uh, yeah. So yeah guys, um I'm not sure what I'm gonna do today. Today's kinda boring. I mean, it is Saturday, so it's the weekend. You know, everyone wants to get out and do things, or some people want to stay home. I mean, I want to do something, but I don't know exactly what I want to do yet. I'm still thinking about it. Uh, I just had lunch. I actually warmed up some pizza pockets. <laughs> I didn't know what to make. And actually, I'm also uh, drinking a cup of coffee right now. I've had this cup for a few years now, actually. Uh, yeah. Just, just so you get that, guys. Just so you know, this is my second cup of coffee today. I made a pot earlier this morning for my first cup. I had uh, waffles for breakfast. If you check out my uh, Instagram, you'll see I posted a picture of the waffles that I made for breakfast. And um, yeah, now I'm having my second cup of coffee over there. And I had pizza pockets for lunch. <laughs> so yeah. Uh, I'm thinking I might go for a bike ride later. Uh, I'm not sure, but now apparently I heard they're calling for rain tomorrow. Cause la cause yesterday I checked the uh, the weather network and they are calling for some rain tomorrow. So hopefully tomorrow it's not bad, but we'll see. I mean it is supposed to be nice today, so I think I might try and get a bike ride today as much as I can. Cause if it's supposed to rain tomorrow, you know if I don't go tonight and if I try going tomorrow, it'll be rain and it'll miss my chance and I'll be upset. So. That's why I might try and get out tonight for a bike ride. So, uh, yeah. And I think I gotta shave. Now, I did... Okay, guys. So, I did promise myself a while back. It was like a month ago. But I said to myself that I was gonna grow my beard for like the fall, winter seasons. And then like in the spring, summer, like the warmer seasons. I would shave my beard. But I kind of want my beard... I kind of want to shave because it's still, it's still gonna be kind of warm for the next little bit. I don't think it's going to start getting colder out until like at least the middle of the month. It's like around like maybe the 15th, the 20th. So, yeah. Excuse me, guys. Sorry. But yeah, um, I might, tr I might, uh, I think I might try and uh, shave my beard. But, yeah. Uh, <laughs> so, yeah. Now, guys. I was talking about this to myself earlier. I know it. Okay, I know it might sound kind of weird when I say I talk to myself. Listen, I do, okay? But, um, no. Uh, I was kind of thinking about this earlier. And, um, so you know how this year we got to have Retrofest and Riffest again? Even though they were different because, well, last year we didn't have them because of COVID, but. This year we got to have them, but Retrofest was virtual for some reason. I don't, I never understood why it was virtual. I mean, I get it was because of COVID, you know, at the time we were in a stay at home order, but you know, virtual, huh? <laughs> you know, like how would that work? Apparently, they, I don't know if they had like a live stream thing, you know, it was kind of weird, you know, it was kind of weird, but yeah, like. But like you know how last year they had the they still had a car cruise downtown even though Retrofest was canceled. Well, I feel like they could have still had a car cruise downtown at least, you know. <laughs> but yeah. And we did somewhat have a somewhat of a Ribfest this year too. Except this year was drive-through cuz 
we were going to have it last year, but that got postponed because of COVID. And it's still postponed, so... Yeah, but I, I just hope... But guys, listen. I just hope that next summer, we get to have a normal rib fest at Tecumseh Park. And I hope next year we get to have a normal retro fest in May as well. Where we can actually have a car cruise and have a car show where people can go to. You know? And again, you know, have a rib fest at Tecumseh Park where... You know, people can actually go to, right? <laughs> you know how they you you know how they usually go, right? Not like virtual or drive through or whatever. You know, normal retro fest and normal rib fest like we usually do. I just hope we have them both next year. You know, normally, right? Hopefully, fingers crossed. Fingers crossed, guys. Yeah, but um, yeah. Like I'm just like seriously, guys. I'm just praying. That next year we get to have a normal retro fest and a normal rib fest at Tecumseh Park. I'm just so hoping, guys. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. So, yeah. <laughs> what's 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 funny is that um, the virtual retro fest and the drive-through rib fest we had this year in Chatham, they both happened in June. They both happened in the same month, which is funny because usually retro fest happens in May. Well, Rip Fest usually happens in July. I mean, in 2019, Retro Fest happened in June because it was also RM's 40th anniversary. And that's another thing. Retro Fest in 2019, I don't know if you guys remember that Retro Fest, but that was a huge Retro Fest. Okay? It was huge. Because not only was it RM's 40th anniversary, well, that was, well, that's been the main reason, but it was just huge because it was RM's 40th anniversary in the you know, it was Retro Fest time, you know, summer. But, uh, yeah. But that, that Retro Fest was huge. Like, there was... I don't think I've seen that big an event in Chatham in my life. Okay? And I've lived in Chatham for 17 years. Okay? And I have not <laughs> see, once in my life seen that big an event in Chatham until that Retro Fest in 2019. Jeez, dude. Like... It was huge. Like, a lot of celebrities were down, I heard. Like, I heard Ellen DeGeneres was in Chatham, Tim Allen, Kid Rock, you name it, you know? Like, I think there were a few others, but I forget who, like, what celebrities were there, too. But all I know, but the only ones I know that were in Chatham were Ellen DeGeneres, Tim Allen, and Kid Rock. So, yeah. And there were two concerts at uh, Retro, at RetroFest, too. Um, the Friday night, they had uh, the Sam Roberts Band play at Tecumseh Park, that was when Kid Rock performed with him, and, uh, the Saturday night, the second day, uh, Big Sugar played at the Capitol Theater, so, yeah, but I heard it was really cool, like, there was a lot of people in Chatham County at the time, like, I don't know if you guys, like, noticed at the time, like, it was more busy at that time, well, that was because, since it was RetroFest, I'm 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 sure a lot of people from like all over Ontario, even the states came down too. Like I heard there were people from Michigan that came down, people from all all over Ontario. Like it was insane. Like there were so many people. That was such a great weekend. It was a great weekend. I honestly will never forget it because it was just amazing. Even though I didn't go to any of the concerts, which I actually really wanted to go to the Sam Roberts concert and the Big Sugar one, but I missed out on both, unfortunately. Yep. So, uh, yeah. But like I said, guys, I just hope that next year we get to have a normal retro fest and a, a normal rib fest at Tecumseh Park. I just hope. Okay? Fingers are crossed. Especially rib fest. <laughs> Especially rib fest at Tecumseh Park. Fingers crossed. Fingers are crossed. That's how. That's how bad I want rib fest. I just want next summer to have for us to have a normal rib fest at Tecumseh Park because rib fest is one of my favorite events in Chatham one of my favorites actually no it's my all-time favorite because the ribs summertime nice weather you know live music a lot of fun people are getting out there rib fest is honestly my favorite event in Chatham like I don't know but like I don't know about you guys but rib fest is one of my favorites comment down below what your favorite Chatham event is or, like, what event in Chatham do you love going to the most? Do you love going to Retro Fest? Do you guys love going to Rip Fest? Do you guys love the Santa Parade? Uh, what else is there? Is that it? 
Are those all the events in Chatham? Because usually the ones we see the most are rip, re, sorry, retro fest, rip fest, and uh, Sam Fried. I don't know what's going on, guys. Lately, it's just been feeling like my mind just hasn't been there. I don't know why. Sorry if I'm sorry if I'm like talking weird or whatever. I don't know what's going on. It's probably because the coffee's just messing with my brain a little bit. It's making me feel like. Uh, jittery a little bit. I should probably cut down on my coffee a little bit. I should probably cut down on my coffee a little bit, at least for right now, but yeah. But anyways, what are your guys' favorite events in Chatham? Retrofest, Ribfest, Santa Parade, or Art in the Park? Me personally, Ribfest. Ribfest is my favorite. I like Retrofest too because like I like seeing all the nice classic cars and like seen cars from like the 50s the 60s the 70s you name it and like even like the 40s or even the 30s or even the 20s you know there's a lot of classic cars in the retro fest and it's always nice seeing those cars downtown and like you know since it's in may usually it happens around my birthday so like the end of may so it happens around my birthday which is why i love retro fest but i also love rip fest because it's in the summertime you know july summer you know, really nice weather, you know, people are getting out there doing things, you know, it's a lot more fun, and, you know, live music, ribs, you know, a lot of fun things to do, right? So, yeah, <laughs> and that's why I'm hoping, guys, that next summer, we get to have a normal rib fest at Tecumseh Park, okay? Fingers crossed, fingers crossed, yeah. Comment down below, like, uh, yeah, again, comment down below what your guys' favorite event is in Chatham. Mine's Ribfest and Retrofest, but mainly Ribfest, so yeah. But fingers are crossed, guys. Fingers are crossed that next year we have a normal Ribfest. That's how bad I want Ribfest. I'm just, I would just want a normal Ribfest so bad. I just wanted to return to the park next year. Hopefully. Hopefully, guys. Oh. <laughs> yeah. And actually, guys, um, the weather's actually really nice. It's actually, like, really sunny. It's actually really warm. Yeah, like, it's actually really warm today. It's so warm, I can literally have my window open. <laughs> I don't even know my... I don't think my air conditioning's on, because uh, we have other windows open in the house. So, yeah. But they are saying... But they were saying it is supposed to be pretty warm today, so... Yeah, but tomorrow's supposed to be raining, I heard, so... Yeah. So, yeah, that's why I'm going to try and get a bike ride out today as much as I can. Maybe it might take some pictures while I'm out. I might see if I can try and go for a bike ride later, maybe, or something like that. But, <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, I'm actually home alone right now. So, yeah, but you guys probably don't care about that. So, <laughs> yeah. And also, guys, uh, one, another thing I want to talk about is I want to start learning... <laughs> Sorry, I want to start learning new th new songs on the on my guitar because I haven't really been playing my guitar as much anymore. I mean, I did learn a new Three Days Grace song, or it's not new, but like I learned a Three Days Grace song, but not like the whole song, but like just the first verse. It's a uh, song "Bitter Taste" off of the "Life Starts Now" album by Three Days Grace. That's the song I'm starting to learn. So yeah. Um, I want to start learning some other songs by, like, Disturbed, Five Finger Death Punch, you know, Trivium, uh, maybe some, I might want to learn some new metal, some more Metallica songs, uh, might want to try and learn Papa Roach, maybe, you know, Theory of a Dead Man, you know, Skillet, those bands, I want to try, I want to, yeah, I, basically what I'm trying to say is I just want to see if I can start learning new songs on guitar, comment down below what song you think I should learn, start learning learn sorry learning how to play I yeah comment down below what song you want me to start learning please don't comment a hard song please because I'm probably not gonna do well so yeah but um yeah so yeah but yeah it's my room by the way you guys probably you guys in my room before so yeah but uh anyway guys um I'm going to get out of here. Thanks for watching. Make sure you guys like this video, subscribe, turn the bell on. Uh, like I said, go subscribe to Channel Boy 12. I'm going to give him a shout out and I'm going to put his 
new video link in the description below is along along with this channel so yeah go check them out and uh yeah all right guys i'm gonna get out of here thanks for watching like subscribe turn on the bell i'll see you all in the next video have a good day everyone